On the cover of his debut album, 181st Songs, Jimmy Wallstein seems too stylish to be a finger-style guitar slinger. His GQ poses and androgynous look don't sit with the usual grizzled or blandly clean-cut anti-image approach that characterizes most acoustic guitar players. But then you hear the impressive technique and realize he isn't like a lot of guitar players anyway. Jimmy Wallstein has all the post Michael Hedges guitar approaches down, including two handed tapping. Playing percussion on his guitar. And generally turning his instrument into an orchestra. The Swedish-born musician grew up as a fan of KISS and has spent the first part of his young career playing on pop music sessions in Sweden. That might be why he brings a keen melodic ear and ranging sensibility to his music. A song like Suffice to Say could be a pop ballad with its song structure and use of electric guitar accents. Jimmy Wallstein can burn the house down with technique, which he does on The Urge to Gossip, a jazzy romp complete with horns. But he can also wax pastoral on Carry Me, a gentle song backed by a string trio. Jimmy Wallstein does it all on this CD. He even picks out the cut you like best. It's called, It's Your Favorite. The title of 181st Songs comes from the street where Jimmy Wallstein lived in New York City, 181st Street. That's where he wrote some of the album. Jimmy Wallstein's 181st Songs is out on Candy Rat Records. I'm John DiLiberto and this has been an Echo Location, Soundings for New Music. Mm-hmm.